I remember the first day I met Rosie. A friend sent over a video of a bunch of stray dogs roaming in the forest outside her house. So I geared up. Rescue mission! When I reached, the strays had left. But something caught on me to explore a little longer. She was no bigger than a little hamster, and she fit perfectly in my palm. You're coming home with me, Rosie. I've had many unsuccessful attempts of bringing a dog home over the years. No. No! But when I appeared at the door with Rosie, my mom immediately softened. Nia? Maybe it was because Rosie was half dead. But anyway, you know that meme? Looking at Rosie now, it's hard to believe that there was a time that we could have lost her forever. She has a really, really slim chance of living. But Rosie's a fighter. When I tell people how Rosie was rescued, their reactions are usually... You're such a saint. You're a dog whisperer. But truthfully, I think it's because I've always just been bad with humans. With dogs, you never feel like your problems are too big for them. Like when you tell them, my mom was just diagnosed with cancer and I feel terrible. Honestly, oh, people struggle to sorry. respond. Lymphoma? That's and I get it. Rare, right? Because if I react Is like this... <gasps> but dogs, they just sit there and listen. Rosie! When my mom got diagnosed, Everyone told me to get rid of Rosie. Black dog means bad luck, ah. If they bark out of nowhere, means got ghosts. If they howl at night, means death is near. But it was my mom who insisted that we kept Rosie. She can help you. She knew that it was a lonely and tough journey ahead, caring for her alone. It was the first time I saw the real devastating impacts of chemotherapy. We'll keep her on observation for the next few days. I came back to an empty home that night. It felt like the whole wall around me was crushing me alive. All my life, I've never dared to depend on others for much. But at that moment, I felt like my whole world depended on this small black dog. And she depended on me. Every moment I felt like breaking, Rosie was there to remind me she was helping me fight this. Today was really shitty. I may have rescued her that day, but over the course of two years, she's constantly rescuing me.